So if we want to increase the size of our uh, SharePoint site collection, what we need to do firstly is log in to the Office 365 uh, portal as an administrator and we're generally presented with the Office 365 Admin Center as you can see. Now to get to the SharePoint administration we go up to Admin on the toolbar in the top right. Uh, click that and you'll see there's an option here for SharePoint so we select that and that will take us to the SharePoint administration part of Office 365. So when this comes up what we'll see is uh, a list of the site collections that I have available um, and then a number of options via the ribbon across the top. So what I'm going to do here is you'll see that I have a default site here um, that currently only has a storage quota of one gigabyte. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to increase this so I will simply select that. When I select that you'll notice a number of uh, buttons on the ribbon uh, then highlight. So I'm going to then select the storage quota button that will present me with a dialogue into which I can then simply go in here and basically type in the additional the total amount of storage that I want to allocate to the SharePoint site. So at the moment um, I have potentially uh, 27 gigs of space. I'm just going to double that up to uh, 2 gig. Simply uh, select that and press save. That will now um, update my site collection as you can see here in the top right hand corner you'll also notice that the site collection has a, a, a little green circle there indicating that it is progressing through that upgrade and uh, adding that additional space. Now the total amount of space that I have available to me app you'll see here um, under the the buttons uh, the ribbon menu at the, across the top so now I have a total available to me of about 26 gig. So in a few uh, in a short period of time this little green uh, circle will disappear and our site collection will be um, upgraded for us. So now you'll see that process has completed and uh, that site collection is now updated and ready to use. So the next question is is that what happens if you want to reduce the amount of space allocated to uh, a SharePoint site collection? So again very similar process all I need to do is select that site collection go into the storage quota again and basically what I can do then is simply change that number back to uh, whatever option that I want. So I could take that straight back to one gig because I know that I've just up updated that but let's say in this case um, I'm not quite sure how much space this site is using. To find that out before I decrease the amount of space is I simply click on um, the site collection to look at its properties and in here you'll notice that there's an option that says storage usage. So this tells me at the moment that that SharePoint site is currently only using a total of two megabytes of space yet it has two gigabytes allocated to it. So in theory what I can do is I can remove um, the amount of space down to that number here. So if I remove one gigabyte that should be more than adequate. So what I can do here is again select this go into storage quota and then I can example change this back to uh, 1 gig and then simply press save that will then uh, basically run through the same process it will update uh, the site collection for me you'll see a little pause a little green spinning circle and again in the top right here you'll see that we get a notification that the site collection is being updated our little green circle reappears um, our storage has been reduced back to one gig uh, and in a matter of moments uh, this site collection will be updated with the new storage quota that we have selected. Okay, so now we see this process um, almost being complete. So what I'll do is just give a quick uh, run over of how we went into this. So again, this ability to change the storage capacity for um, SharePoint site collections is part of the M and the E plans. Uh, it is currently not available for the small business or the P plans. The way that we got to uh, that option was basically going into our Office 365 portal as an administrator and then going up to admin in the top right hand corner there selecting SharePoint that then takes us to this SharePoint admin center we then simply selected the site collection we wanted to work on and then selected the storage quota button um, to make the changes whether up or down 
to our site collection. And again, if you want to see quickly how much space this site collection currently is consuming, you just click on it to get the properties and you'll see under the storage usage the current storage that this site collection is using. So that's all for this video. Thank you very much for watching.